Thank you. We'll start with you, Ms. Blankenbecker. You're a nurse in the Navy and served in New York City on the USNS Comfort, sent there to help if hospitals were overrun during COVID. During that time, you did contract COVID-19. How would you respond if you heard someone call this virus a hoax? Well, I mean, it's clear there's a virus out there. It's not to say, I think that, that there's a difference between the virus and the fear, and we had a, a exceptional fear. Now that we've seen the CDC reports where we, the original models of this said that millions of people were gonna die, and now CDC has come down and they have dropped their numbers of COVID-related deaths by 96%. Um, you know, most of the people who get the virus, and I mean the big majority, um, suffer cold-like symptoms. And so, um, you know, it's it's not, and, and that's what I had. It's, it's um, you know, and, and of course, any person who dies from a virus, we, we certainly have to take safeguards and protections to keep those people safe, especially our most vulnerable populations. But we really needed to get control of the fear. Thank you. And Mr. Negron, do you think people have overreacted to the virus? And along those lines, what would you say to a family member of a Granite Stater who has died, who is warning others to take it seriously? Well, certainly uh, to that family, a Granite Stater family, uh, my sincerest condolences um, to any family um, that loses a member. Um, and no, it's not a hoax. I think what, what the hoax is was that it was the fear that was pandering about we were going to have, you know, these millions of deaths. Um, as a result of this pandemic. And it's clear that that has not, um, that has not come to fruition. So it isn't necessarily, we understand that, there's a, that there is a, a, an issue out there, that there is a certain population that is more susceptible, and we need to protect those. But the hoax was the fear mongering that the Democrats want to do, that Ann Custer wants to do. You know, she put out a plan that talks about stay at home, don't do this, don't do that. We're the party of, of hope. Um, that's what we need to do. You know, it's about building our future, um, not keeping people af afraid. You know, there's a great... Um, picture there was one Australian sheepdog controlling a hundred sheep and the question is how does one person control a hundred sheep and it's by fear and that's what the Dems are trying to do to us.